Hi, this is Dr. Robert Izor. I'm a neurologist at Neurology Solutions Movement Disorder Center. We're a comprehensive treatment center specializing in Parkinson's disease, tremor, and dystonia, located in Austin, Texas. This presentation is part of a series of videos designed to educate and promote longer and better quality of life, not just for our patients, but for the community we serve. Please contact us at 512-977-7000 if you would like a consultation. So today I would like to present a brief lecture on metabolic enhancement for neurodegenerative disease. So many neurodegenerative disorders like Parkinson's and Alzheimer's are caused by pathological changes in metabolism. Some disorders are specifically caused by reduced or toxic exp expression of certain proteins leading to cell death and or loss of function. Some examples include spinocerebellar ataxia and Friedrich's ataxia and also Huntington's disease. In these disorders, the proteins that are produced are abnormal, uh, and it's not that they necessarily accumulate, they just cause toxic events that, that end up uh, with cells dying and loss of function. Now in other cases, the pathology of the disease is caused by an accumulation of relatively normal proteins that are sometimes misfolded, uh, and they aggregate, and, and this eventually becomes toxic to the cells and causes them to die. Uh, some of these disorders, like Parkinson's disease, uh, and multiple system atrophy involve accumulation of a protein called alpha-synuclein. Uh, there are other similar disorders that involve dementia like frontotemporal dementia, uh, corticobasal degeneration, and progressive supranuclear palsy. These involve another protein called tau, which also accumulates and becomes toxic. And then Alzheimer's uh, involves two proteins, uh, both beta amyloid and tau, and these produce uh, amyloid plaques and fibrillary tangles, and these become toxic. So we think that enhancing metabolism may be a way to improve outcomes in these latter disorders where relatively normal proteins accumulate and cause toxicity. Our practice has begun implementing uh, protocols initially developed at UCLA called Metabolic Enhancement for Neurodegenerative Disease, and this was developed by Dr. Dale Bredesen. Uh, it's also known as MEND, uh, the MEND protocol. Uh, so prior attempts to improve individual parameters alone have not shown significant improvement in Parkinson's and Alzheimer's studies. However, neuro neurodegenerative diseases are complex multi-system disorders, and changing overall metabolism may have a larger impact, altering the pathological progression of these diseases. Uh, MEND improves metabolic function by wide-ranging efforts to optimize multiple metabolic parameters at the same time such as optimizing lifestyle, nutrition, sleep, and using various supplements to treat suboptimal metabol metabolic parameters. This series of videos intends to outline various areas of metabolism that may be optimized in the hopes of improving quality of life by preventing, slowing, or reversing disability caused by these neurodegenerative diseases. This presentation is offered by Neurology Solutions Movement Disorder Center. It's part of a series of videos designed to educate and promote, promote longer and better quality of life, not just for our patients, but for the community we serve. We hope you enjoyed this content. Please contact us at 512-977-7000 if you would like a consultation for yourself or a family member. Thank you for your time.